Hey guys, it's Speed here, and um, I just got back from doing something, and I got lots of money and stuff. So I started um, researching uh, um, these, and so now I'm gonna have regrow balloons to send to people, and that'll be pretty cool. And so right now, um, I have these upgrades for the monkey buccaneer, these for the sniper and darling all that. I got the regrow tech. I'm pretty, I think right now I'm gonna save up for the Moab Maulers. That's pretty much what I'm gonna do. And then after I get that, I'll get the bigger blast. After I get the Moab Maulers, then I'll get the signal flare and then get the bigger blast. And then after that, I will get the cluster bombs. Cause that stuff's pretty expensive. And then I might, I think I'm probably gonna get this, the clay ricochet and the bionic boomer. But that's gonna be a while. And then I'll get the, this upgrade and this upgrade. So yeah. That'll help me for camo leads. Um, because camo leads are very hard. Whoa. I don't know why that keeps happening. So yeah. Um so let's see how much the camo the camera protection for the sniper cost. One thousand four hundred, that's quite a lot of money. So I think right now we're gonna attack a ceramic tile. Let's see if we can do it. I think we can. We can defeat ceramics. Um yeah. Yeah, this is a very easy place. And now that we leveled up, I think I was like farming and I leveled up, we can now start out with a darling gun. So that's pretty cool. It's just not very accurate at all. But, who cares? Oh my gosh, it's missing red blues. That's just kind of hilarious. Oh my gosh. If I can't even, like, hit barely anything, it's going to be just hilarious. <laughs> okay. Um. There we go. Increased accuracy, there we go. So there you go. That's much better. So there's 19 rounds. That's a lot more rounds than we're usually. The weird thing that I think that's the biggest jump is the low the highest level that's not ceramics below ceramics is lead. So you jump from uh, leads to ceramics, and that's a pretty big jump. And then you jump straight to Moabs. Once you get to Moabs, you're pretty much set until you get to like the ZOMGs and the DDTs, and then the quadruplet, or the quintuplet, or five, or however you say that, um, ceramics, and then get to the triple Moabs and double BFBs. And then you just get to later tiles, it just becomes more difficult. Even if you have just a single BFB, if you have your first single BFB, and then you go to another BFB, like much further back, it'll be a lot harder, even though it's the same thing. So yeah, just kind of something to think about. So yeah, um, we're coming this pretty easily. I think next episode, after we get the Moab Maulers, we might try to go for a Moab tile. But we need to, do, we do need to get some camo leads, and that's why we need to get the signal flare for the mortar. So it can pop through those camos. Um, so yeah. And now we're probably gonna get something for leads. We should probably get a mortar. Yeah. I would say a bomb tower, but I think mortar's better. Yeah, probably. We'll make it shoot like right here. That'll be a good spot. And yeah. Oh, I'm sorry if my voice is sounding a little bit low because I was like sitting away from the mic. So yeah. And I'm not sure for camo labs we should either get the signal flare, which is the most expensive, the camo detection for the sniper, or the um, this upgrade for the um, darling. I'm thinking the signal flare, but the um, darling is a good choice. It only costs a thousand dollars, and so does the camera detection for the these 
And that means the darlings can also pop regular LEDs too, not just candle LEDs. They can pop anything. They can pop anything. Okay, so we almost have enough for the mortar just once this round ends. There we go. B is for mortar. Well, at least that's a hockey board. That's not really what it spells, but you know who cares. Go mortar! Good job. Okay. Oh, we need to get the rapid fire. I'm not sure if I should get the increased accuracy first or the burning stuff. I think probably the burning stuff first. I mean, I kind of want to get the increased accuracy, but you definitely want to get the burning stuff. I was about to click the increased accuracy there for a second. Um, yeah. So if you guys don't know how to use hotkeys, it's period for the left upgrade side and comma for the right upgrade side. So if you want to say you want to upgrade the path and you're aiming a darling gun or trying to get bananas from your farm, just use those hotkeys and you'll be fine. It does take a while of getting used to, but it's worth it. And I don't think the spike factory's even done anything yet. It's only popped 21 balloons. Now we haven't gotten In order to complete this call. What in the world? Okay, that was weird. Uh okay. Okay. Uh Okay, so camel blooms, those aren't too bad. Then Oh, that burning stuff. Okay, so we have two mortars now, so in case there's any other but right now I think we're probably just gonna get a sniper for those stronger balloons. Put it on strong. And that burning stuff should take care of the rest. That upgrade, need the faster shooting, it's a good upgrade. The mortar's good for group balloons, the sniper's good for strong balloons, and the jarling is in between. So that strategy is pretty good strategy. Uh, glue gunners are pretty good for strong balloons too. They're good to slow them down so other towers can do them. So I think I might unlock the glue gunners soon, but right now I'm focusing on upgrading my towers, not getting new ones. So if you guys want me to get a certain tower that you want me to try out, uh, just post in the comments, and once I'm done getting the Moab Maulers, I will get that tower. So, yeah. That Bernie stuff is getting all those balloons, burning them, putting them on fire. And that... Ooh, I don't know, I don't know. Go Bernie stuff. That's like a really good spot for the Bernie stuff. It can hit pretty much every balloon. If a million pinks got by, if a million pinks were coming, it would pop awful all of them. So we're gonna get another darling. Right, no, I saw it, there was a spot right there, yeah. Increased accuracy. A lot of people try to go for the zero one upgrade before the one zero upgrade, but I honestly think, uh, why do I have the popping sounds on? There we go, that's a lot better. That was probably very annoying. Okay, right, um, so, uh, yeah, a lot of people get the zero one upgrade before the um one zero upgrade because it can pop through three balloons, and I understand that. But it's not even gonna pop through three balloons if you have it on inaccurate, unless there's like tons and tons of group balloons, which there really isn't in the early rounds. Usually, there's just like. Like in the early rounds on Balloons Monkey City, really, there's no group balloons until you get to like round five, and then that's when there actually starts being group balloons. And then that's that's pretty much it, so. 
Oh, well, I have tons of money right now. Tons and tons of money. I'm gonna upgrade our spike factory. Get a little bomb tail right here. Put it on close. And that's gonna help with some more group balloons. I think we kinda need to, we got so we got stuff for our streaming. I bet we could actually win if we didn't do anything. I'm going to take that challenge that you guys silently gave me. And I'm not gonna buy anything else except for that bigger bombs. And once I get this bigger bombs, I'm not gonna buy anything else. I will aim my darlings. But I'm not gonna buy anything else. I mean, if I really have to, I will, but I'm like, didn't try not to buy anything else. Like, even if I have $5,000, $10,000, I'm not gonna buy anything else. Except for that upgrade and that upgrade. Look at that bomb tower, look at him go. He said he popped 171 balloons and I just got him. Look at that mortar, he's popped 1,000, 1,068. That's a lot of balloons. This darling has popped 4,000 balloons. Let's see. I need to make sure that's a good spot. Mm, it could be a little bit more this way. I think that might be good. There we go. Yeah. Wait, there we go. There we go. Now, fast forward. We already have... Fourteen hundred dollars, but I don't think we're gonna need anything else. And the weird thing is, even with the increased accuracy on the darlings, it's not really that accurate. I mean, it is accurate, but I, I know I've already said this, but it's like not completely accurate. Like it still goes ways. Like if you're shooting down a straight pass, like sometimes it will not shoot all that. Look at that Bernie stuff. It pot burned all those balloons, and we did not have Bernie stuff. We probably would not have been able to beat that round. Well, maybe our spike factory would have been able to handle it, but that's pretty much it. So we're already around 15. So it looks like we're taking this down pretty easily. We haven't had to use um, any other towers. We almost have $4,000. So this these ceramic towers give you lots of money. Oh, I just thought of it. What if there's camo leads? That would be that would be really bad. I'd have to use a pineapple. Yeah, so yeah, if I if I have, if a camel lab comes out, I will use a pineapple because I have five of those. I got those just in case for um, leads, camel leads, and in case a uh, lead comes out on like round one when they have a spike factor in their darling, that would be bad. But so yeah, I'm really liking this music. Yeah, go music. Ooh, some regrow leads mixing in with regrow pinks. But good job, sniper, you popped all of them. And we have 5,300 and 5,400, 5,500 dollars. Now, there we go. And now we're even getting more, 5,600 dollars, 5,700, 5,800, 5, Oh, camo leads! That's a lot of camo leads right there. Oh my gosh! Good job, pineapples. I'm so glad I have you. Oh, they're regrowing. No, don't regrow. No, did I just lose because of camo? Oh my gosh! Oh, this is a failure of an episode. Regrow camo leads. Those are my death. Those are definitely my death. Oh my gosh. I'm glad that regrow camos cannot regrow back into camos if you have the signal flare. Because that would be very, very bad. Okay, so now I'm kind of mad. So I'm going the monkey versus monkey somebody. Because um, I'm mad. So attack friend level. So who's at level, the lowest level that I can attack? I already attacked him. I already attacked him. Attack J6295. Going to attack him with leads. There we go. We're going to say good luck, revenge attack, please. Good luck. Because I really want someone to attack me. Oh my gosh, why is it doing that? Good luck. Oh my gosh. Do 
Wait, no, why did I do that again? There you go. Go. I'm only using three bloom stones, so that's not too bad. And attack has been deployed. Yes. Yes, that is very good. Whoa. I've captured 84 pieces of land for the glory of Awesome 03. Huh. That's cool it says that. Need 3000 XP for the next level. No. Attack shooter. Is there anything I can get? Moab Mauler. I can't get those yet. Uh, ceramic balloon construction. I'll keep it to bigger vaults. Feeding a Moab. Yeah, we're going to do that soon. Upgrading the windmill. We have so much quest that we need to do right now. We're leveling up way too fast. 150 pieces of land. That's almost double what I captured right now. I really need to attack this ship direct, but I don't have camel detection and I don't have lead popping power for my boats yet. I need to get these two upgrades and maybe this one. I don't know. And maybe the destroyer. That would that would be effective too. But those cost a lot of money. So yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and have a great day.